Hey, welcome back to the cabin. Um, today I'm sort of multitasking. Um, uh, I'm up at my solar ray. This morning I was collecting wood for the uh, um, the woodshed, but because there wasn't too many bugs, I thought, okay, well, I'll crack on with my solar panel. Um, because what I'm going to do, I decided to um, add another solar panel to my solar ray. I think the rationale for that is that when I set this up last year, um, I had to cut down so many trees to get this thing in here, to get some sunlight on the panels, because obviously, you know, I'm in the middle of a forest, right? So um, I'm not an arborist as well. So I think I'd be happy with three panels if I had more sun hours on the panel, because at the moment, there's so many trees up here, I'd have to cut down more trees um, to enable these panels to get more sun during the daytime so to maximize the energy I can get up here I decided to add another panel um, so that I'll get more power during that short period of time that I actually have sun on the panels if you understand what I mean um, so that's my rationale because I don't want to cut down trees because it's a bugger to do that and as you know it's hard work I mean I, I cut down quite a few trees behind the camera um, and there's still some down there I got to cut up but I'll do it in the autumn um, when it cools down I'll just cut that up for firewood and stuff um, so yeah so that's what I'm gonna do so these are like 340 watt uh, Hanwha Q-cell panels so at the moment they're wired in series because my grow watt all-in-one inverter that I have in the cabin that only accepts 145 volts open circuit right so if I was to add another 340 watts solar panel and wire those in seri series it'd be well over 145 volts so what I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna wire them in series parallel and then I'll be fine right so the other thing is I, I dug the holes I wasn't sure really if I was gonna be able to dig uh, you know dig in to, to put the fence posts in because on this one here the way I designed this one it's actually sitting on a granite boulder so I had to actually had to drill into the to the granite to fasten the footings that I actually bought right if you're interested in that have a look at my uh, video installation of the solar panel and that sort of goes into more detail how that works so in in some say, sense I've, I've locked out really because all I have to do is just get some um, fence post cement uh, I already dug the holes this morning because the bugs weren't too bad so I've got a fence post that I can use from last year, an off cut. Uh, there might be another one under the cabin and there might be some 2x4s under the cabin, I can't remember but so if there isn't another 4x4 I just have to buy one and, and I'll just buy some fence post cement and then I'll, I'll sort, that, sort that out and then I'll just go and see if I can get another solar panel and then I'll wire it all up. Um, so then I'll have loads of power. So if I only have like four or five sun hours a day, if I've got four panels, then I'm gonna get more energy than, I, than if I have three, right? I mean, at the moment it's fine. It, you know, it, it charges my battery, but if I have more people up at the cabin and everyone has smartphones and tablets and what have you, then it's just, it's pushing it, right? So I think if I add another solar panel, then I'll have, you know, loads of power, hopefully. That's the plan. And if that's not, if it doesn't work out the way I think it does, then I'll have to cut down some more trees to get some more sun hour. But I don't really want to do that because I do like the trees up here. You know, it's so nice having trees up here. Um, but so that's my plan. I think if I just stick with one solar panel, then I'll review it. I'll see how, what my energy consumption is because the family are coming out again from England in the summer. So. Um, I'll know for sure when they're up at the cabin because, you know, as I say, they've got their phones and everything. So it just, I consume more energy when there's more people in the house. If it's just me or maybe my wife, if it was just two of us, then I think we'd probably be fine with just the extra solar panel. Um, yeah, and I think that, that I think we'd be, we'd be sorted. So, um, so that's the plan anyway. So I think what I, the next step is to see what I got under my cabin. What would I have under there? Um, and then I'll maybe I'll just pop out and buy another fence post um, 
uh, and then sort all that out. I'll set the fence posts um, and see if I can get this solar panel up and running pretty quickly. And then I can just... Well, I think what I'm going to be doing is doing both the woodshed and the solar array. I'll just be doing it simultaneously, I think. Um, and I think that's it. And then I'm going to just like chill out and I'm going to go and maybe make some paths on my land and stuff like that. Because I haven't had time. I mean, I've been working, you know, uh, and just coming out here, um, you know, for four weeks leave, you know, because I've obviously I've been living in England for years. So uh, I could only come out to Canada for four weeks. So I really couldn't do a lot in those four weeks. So um, since I retired last year, now I've got loads of time to, to do stuff, but I just don't want to be doing stuff all the time i want to be able to enjoy it and do stuff on the land and stuff so yeah so that's what i'm going to do do the woodshed sort this solar panel out and then i'm just gonna uh just chill and just um explore a bit of the land and stuff i mean i have been around all the four corners of the land and stuff but it was only quickly i haven't actually explored it that much since we bought the property a few years ago because as i say you know i just hadn't had the time um uh, but anyway, okay, I uh, just want to say thanks again for all you guys out there um, watching my videos I hope I'm not boring you or anything like that and thanks for the thumbs up So I'll let you go because I got shit to do and, I'm, and the bugs are I think the bugs are starting to come again. Okay. Cheers. Cheers for watching